Hello, Anna, and hello, all the viewers. We are back with our next episode. And today we will again we'll continue our different classical Hindustani rag that we have been covering. This is the fourth episode. Today, which rag you want to present to us, Anna? Today I'm going to be going over rag kafi. All right. So rag kafi, what I've heard, obviously, I've heard a little bit, little bit about so many rags, but all I know about kafi is that it's a rag to celebrate holy, to celebrate colors, to celebrate life. Very happy rag. Also, I know that uh, there are some rags that are that, that came from folk music of India. Kafi is one such rag which has all these, which is often mixed with other notes. And there is a lot of uh, happy, kind of cheerful mood in uh, holy based songs and so on. But that's all my little knowledge. But you tell us the technical details, the Aro, the Avro, Pakar, Bandesh, and all that, Vadi Samadhi, and all that. Yeah. All right. So, um, the the, the facts about kafi is that the thought is kafi, it is <laughs> own thought. The, the swar is komal ga ni, the verded swar is none. And the time of day which is sung is you can sing it anytime. Right. So, and, like I was mentioning, the folk music based classical rag are, are the most evergreen rags bhairvi, kafi, pahadi, they can be sung anytime. So, kafi fits the, that category pretty well, yes. So, what, what is the vadi swar in kafi? The, the vadi is pa and the samvadi is sa. So most prominent swar is pa and samvadi is sa. Yes. Right? So samvadi is sa means yeah, the lowest note, pa is a little bit higher, fifth note. All right. Uh, what else? Uh, time of the day is any time. Thart, let me just remind everybody that thart is the group of different rags that were sort of manually created these uh, groups called tharts by Bhatkandeji, a renowned a very high legendary scholar coming from Maharashtra in like, I think in last hundred years or so, he came up with these, you know, excellent way of categorizing hundreds and hundreds of Hindustani uh, rags into these groups. And so, so the name of the group is also Kafi, name of the rag is Kafi also. And yeah, what else can you tell us about Kafi rag? Um, the Jati is Sampurna. That means it has seven notes right. in the ascending and seven notes in descending. All right. All seven notes are used for ascending and for descending. Aro and Avro. Yes. Okay. What else? Okay. I'm going to sing the Aro and Avro. All right. Sure. So, right. All right. So, any flat or tibr should that kind of thing? Yeah, the, the, the swar is komal ga ni. So, it means like it's slightly below the pitch. Oh, there you go. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. All right. So, those are the technical details which I miss out, but you know, because you've learned classical. All right. What else? So now you want to sing us uh, Bandish? Sing a Bandish for us? Yes, I'm going to sing the Bandish. All right, go ahead. Okay. Coffee. So it has to be holy Bandish. So it's always holy, holy, holy. Yes, in coffee. Go ahead. Yeah. Aja ke lo shama sanga hori. Aja ke lo shama sanga hori. Aja ke lo shama sanga hori. Vichagari ranga bari kesaraki aja Vichagari ranga bari kesaraki aja khelo shama sanga hori Tuvara ka naiya sanga sakhi Okay. Yes, it's pretty right. small bandish. Oh, okay. All right. Uh, yeah, so like I was uh, hinting, there are several, several film songs, Hindi film songs. Uh, I think there is uh, this default rule that if it is a holy song, 
they use Raag Kafi to compose the lyrics into to make it a, a film music, film song. So the song that I have in mind is coming from a very old black and white film called Godan, which has Be Rajume, Holi Ke Latinandalal. That's a holy song. Then uh, another very very uh, popular ghazal uh, by Jagjit Singh. Tum nahi gham nahi sharab nahi. Something like that. It goes. Uh, then there is a, another song from another very you know old film, black and white film from called Chacha Zindabad, and the song goes. Does it sound similar to any thing that you have heard? Yeah, it sounds similar to the bandha I was just singing. Okay, okay. So like when, when it goes up, it sounds similar. Okay. Uh, then another song also from an old film. I think it came in early 80s, 1980s. Song goes, Dil ke tukde, tukde karke, muskura ke chal diye. Jate jate ye to bata ja, hum jiyenge kiske liye. Dil ke tukde, tukde karke, muskura ke chal diye. Does that sound like a coffee? Yes, kind of, because it went like down and then like like um, oh. it sounded similar to the oh, okay yeah. overall sounds similar to the overall. All right, then again, there's very rare song, I mean, not very popular song, but yeah, other than the holy songs, um, I guess that's about it. So, coffee is not very as popular as some of the other rags in Hindi films. Uh, and there is no tarana, you said, but tum tum tarana tum, that, that thing is not no. in coffee. Okay. No. Apparently, I, I wonder why, because Bhairavi does have a tarana, which is also a folk based classical rag, but then coffee, uh, probably we have to learn more to get to that tarana level. Anything else on coffee you want to share? Uh, no, that's about it. All right, anything? All right, then that's it. It's going to be a short episode then. Thank you. Mm -hmm. yeah. Thanks.